So I did a video just talking a little bit about how to use this vintage, vintage Singer sewing machine. Um, the uh, My viewer came back and asked me if I would talk about the foot pedal. Now I'm going to show you this foot pedal. You can see it is quite different from any foot pedal I've ever seen. It's a little dirty because obviously it stays on the floor. Um, I do have my machine plugged up which means it will run if I push this down so I've got to be careful. I, I've never seen a foot pedal like this and I don't know um, probably I should have done more research before doing the video. I'm not sure if my viewer did not tell me if this is the one he has or um, what exactly his question was but I'm assuming I looking at the wires this looks like an old um, cord so this is probably either original or very close to the original um, foot pedal so what happens here is I think this foot pedal kind of has this break here and this is it doesn't do anything it doesn't move you can't mash it down it's I think just a place to a place to rest your foot while you're not using the machine and the trick is and I'm gonna try to do this with my hand and control um, the the fabric here so I can show you what it does but you would press your foot here and I feel like I feel like with this machine this is um, maybe sort of meant as a safety precaution I don't know because you really have to get right there and you have to I have a lot of trouble using it if I'm barefooted and um, I'll just put it that way I don't know if my feet are just sensitive or what but um you have to press this pedal down and I do have my machine in reverse let me put it in the right position get the, so basically you would push with your foot here and then when you're when you're not sewing this is kind of the rested position you've got this it's got grooves in it and it's it's comfortable to rest your foot on and I like it a lot better than any other foot pedal I've seen because you can't rest your foot on a, a foot pedal that the whole pedal comes down but you can on this one you can rest your foot between sewing and that way it, your foot is always on the pedal but it doesn't have to always be on the gas I guess you could say so you see this pressing with this and then if you put your whole foot down here you're going to have to press some toes to get it to go that way so you basically you can rest your foot this way and you can put your foot over to move the gears and get it going so I mean that's basic and I'm pretty sure this is original to this machine has a part number on it um, this is a pretty solid little foot pedal. I was, I was actually really excited about that part of it when my daughter got me this machine. And it took some getting used to because a lot of times um, I would think that it had stopped working or something because I would be pressing this whole thing down and when you're feeling it with your foot, you're so used to just pushing that whole pedal down and I would be just getting on there with my foot I was like, it's not working, and I forgot it has a button. So that's, you know, just how this works. And if it is not working, um, let me get that fabric out of the way. My recommendation to you is to take it to um, a, somebody who knows how to fix it. And mine, this is the original one that came with the machine when my daughter bought it. I'm not sure if it came with the machine when it was brand new, but I would think so. So anyway, that's how this pedal works, and it's, you know, it's neat. I think they should make um, newer sewing machines with pedals like this because it, it's safer, I feel like. I like it a lot. I like the way it works. So that's it. That's how the foot pedal works on this Vintage Singer sewing machine. If you have any other questions about the machine, I'll be happy to answer them for you. I'm, I'm not real keen on um, copying the little manual that I have and, and posting it online just because it's just a lot of trouble. And if only one or two people are going to need it, I'm not going to do that. So um, I'll answer any questions though if I have to flip my manual open and, and answer them for you, I'll do that. But I'm not going to go through the trouble of scanning it and uploading it. So anyway, that's the foot pedal. 
Peace, y'all. Bye-bye.